happening today. Funeral plans set for a Citronelle High School student killed in an ATV crash on Friday. Anna Weaver was a freshman honor student at the school. News 5's Chad Petrie is following that story. He's got details live this morning. Good morning, Chad. Good morning, Bill. Good morning, Jessica. Yeah, it's probably going to be a very sad week in Citronelle and much of that part of Mobile County as a whole. Tonight will be awake for Anna Weaver. That'll be held from 6 to 9 at Restoration Church at 8520 State Street in Citronelle. Tomorrow, a funeral service will be at the same location. That'll be Wednesday morning at 11. Family and faculty continuing to remember the life of Anna Weaver. Monday morning, students and teachers gathered at the flagpole outside the high school to pray. The loss of Anna Weaver has dealt a big blow to this tight-knit community. Monday morning, people held hands and hugged over the huge loss. Teachers say it's okay to be sad, it's okay to cry. Her youth pastor says Anna Weaver touched the lives of virtually everyone in the school. She always just lit up the room every time she, she walked in, and um, it's going to be it's going to be hard for our students and uh, for our youth group and going forward, but. Um, we know Anna's in a lot better place right now. She's in heaven, and um, she wouldn't come back now if she even had a chance to. One. We love you, Anna. Students also release balloons at the football practice field as part of their tribute to the late ninth grader. A second young woman also heard in the ATV crash was treated and released from the hospital, according to the Mobile County Sheriff's Office. Reporting live in Mobile County, Chad Petrie, WKRG News 5.